Hello, welcome to another video. Now, remember when I was at Skankendom and I promised to stay with you and on the mazes? And today or tonight, here it is. Our first maze from Paradise Foundation. That's the first maze that you go to when you enter Skirt Kingdom. And I really, really enjoyed that maze. The first maze, Paradise Foundation. That's the first maze you enter when you enter uh, Skirt Kingdom. And what a fantastic maze that was. Um, when you enter through the Paradise Foundation is you are fully immersed into a laboratory which has gone horribly crazy uh, wrong but in the best way ever it is the start of your journey throughout the mazes of Sky Kingdom and it sets it all up. It is fantastic. First maze, fantastic start. Maze number two. Mana Mortis. I really, really enjoy this maze. It's kind of one of my favorites. I do have another one, which is, which sits right next to it, but this maze will always be on top. This is a great maze. So Mano Nortis is basically um, immersed into a Victorian haunted house and the theming is fantastic. The theming as you're waiting outside is on a different, the theming as you're waiting outside of Manor uh, Mortis is utterly fantastic. It looks proper gothic and proper Victorian. You are immersed from the moment you set foot waiting to go into the house, which as you walk in, you are just, you are immersed. Like, each stream that you go and you are just immersed. It's fantastic maze. I'm so happy that, just, uh, just so happy that, that it's still there. It's been there for like a lot of years. It's my, it's my best maze ever. Fantastic maze. I just love the gothic Victorian look. And the actors are, t are top notch. Uh, the storyline is so dark and I, it's just fantastic. So yeah, that's a thumbs up for that show. I love that maze so much. Maze number three, three, yes, three, Gothic Hana. Like I said, uh, this maze is the maze that is right next to Mana, Mana Mortis. But, so, Gothic Hana is a new maze for Halloween 2022. Um, it's kind of like uh, you're in a church, a type of thing. So it's still like gothic, you know, um, it's still Victorian and that, but it's a lot different than in Man uh, Hortis. Um, it's a lot darker than that, um, so yeah. Not trying to give information away because I'm sure that uh, most of you have seen it, most of you may have not seen it. But yeah, it's a lot darker 
it's um, it's just it, it's just it's just an amazing uh, it's really really dark it's about on the same uh, the same uh, the same like dark level as man at mortis is and it's just as amazing as man uh, man uh, mortis it's just as amazing so you're walking through you're trying to walk through old london you're trying to get away from the bodies bodies snatches while you're trying to uncover the truth and it's really dark it's uh you've got creatures coming at you uh, Everywhere you go, um, the story is just amazing. Um, yeah, um, I think uh, the sets are amazing. The acting is really good. And yeah, it's up there with, uh, with, it's up there with the Paradise Foundation, uh, Mana Mortis and Gothica, which is my favorite maze. Shh. Don't tell Manny Mortis. The last maze, The Devil's Night, which is the Devil's Night is very like clown themed. And um, so you're walking through this, this abandoned circus. Uh, so you're like walking through, uh, I think you're walking on um, hey, and that joking uh, uh, through, joking uh, through did that walls and that. But I have to be honest, I wasn't really, um, uh, um, I wasn't really overwhelmed with that, um, with uh, with that maze. It, uh, so what? It kind of like lacked is uh, some actor that coming at you. Um, some of the time, uh, you just like walking uh, through the walls and that. Uh, uh, but the actors that you do see are kind of, um, kind of at the end. Uh, but uh, that you do see are. Fantastic. Um, they're really good actors in there. Um, um, and the, and the finale with a big clown, um, uh, just chases you with a huge chainsaw. And that's, uh, um, and that makes up for it that, uh, that makes up for it that bit is just amazing. And so, Overall, I had a really good time. Thank you, Scare Kingdom, for an epic night once again. We all enjoyed it, and I can't wait for next Halloween. It's going to be great. The kind of a first me. I don't really do this uh, personally. I don't really do reviews. I just, uh, you know, I, I'm trying to do vlogs and things I put that different stuff onto my channel so I hope uh, that my content is okay and that I guess oh with that being said I should bid you farewell thank you for watching this random video um, and yeah I'm a bit sad that scary season is over now I can't really say stay scary now can I I'm just going to have to say this. I'll catch you guys later. And take care of yourselves. I'll, and I'll see you in this one.